vision boards, if you heard me two days ago, go, they're great, but they tend to tell the universe, it can only look like that. The universe goes, okay, so what if it shows up like that? Are you gonna filter that out? Are you gonna filter that out? Which is what happens more often than not. And opportunities go by. There's a great old story, maybe you've heard it. The earth was starting to flood and there's a guy was on top of his roof of his house. And first of all, a robo guy comes by the robot and says, hey, you want to ride? He goes, no, 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 God's going to save me. Cool. Next boat comes by, there's a few people on, it's a motorboat. Water's rising. Hey man, you want to get in the boat? No, no, no. Good. God's going to save me. Then the last cruise ship comes by, he's standing there on the tiptoe and he goes, hey man, you want to get on the boat? This is the last boat that's going to go under. No, no, no. God's going to save me. He drowns, gets to heaven and goes, yo God, what the I thought you were gonna save me. He goes, hey, duh, I sent you three times, but you were so concerned that I was gonna save you that you missed the invitation when I already did. It's an old story I didn't create it. It's been around a long time. But it gives us a clue. We're so convinced it's gotta look like that. It's gotta feel like that. It's gotta sound like that. It's gotta taste like that. It's gotta smell like that because our conscious ego has said, that's what's best for us, outside in model. And the universe goes, okay. That's what you want to create.